let us continue with the design problem of chimneys this is the part 3 we are about to discuss uh, stresses in concrete due to temperature this is the expression uh, sig sigma c dash into sorry is equal to ec into alpha into t into pi by 1 plus a minus k dash by k dash so ec is here uh, the moyang's modulus of the concrete we got it uh, from the modular ratio that is 19090 0.9 newton per mm square it is initially found out please look at that alpha is a coefficient of expansion temperature coefficient that is a 12 into 10 power minus 6 per degree centigrade that is uh, for both concrete and steel t is at 75 degrees centigrade as given in the problem a is a 0 0.875 we have calculated that k dash is 0 0.70 we got it so if you substitute all the values here you will get uh, this uh, sigma c dash as 11 newton per mm square the permissible compressive stresses for m25 grade of concrete uh, when the wind load is co considered it is given by this uh, expression that is 1.33 multiplied by the sigma cbc 1.33 into sigma cbc is 8.5 taken from minus 456 that is 11.33 that is so the value we got is less than the permissible value so it is safe so in the next point we have to see the stresses in steel due to temperature that is sigma s dash is equal to m into sigma dash into sigma c dash into a minus k by k dash sigma c we have found out here so m, m value is modular ratio 11 a is a 0 0.875 k dash is a 0 0.70 after that after substituting all the values you will get sigma s dash as 30.25 which is less than 230 newton per mm square so hence it is safe next tension zone we have to see the second part so all these values are for compression zone the now let us see for the same for tension zone here the expression is this p into sigma s by pm into a minus k dash by k dash minus k dash by 2 he is equal to alpha t e c k dash of course all the values are known values initially we have calculated all the values but k dash as it is tension zone the k value k dash value will differ now we have to find out taking all the values we have to find out the value of k dash using this expression so after getting after all these are the values we have so after getting all the values substitute now in the expression so x, uh, k dash is given by 0.55 if we solve for k dash that is 0.55 next stresses in concrete we have to find out the expression is this gamma c dash is equal to alpha t e c into k dash so all the values are known alpha is a coefficient of uh, thermal expansion of concrete and steel t is a th uh, temperature EC is a Young's modulus of the uh, concrete found out from modular ratio of Young's, uh, and Young's modulus of steel. K dash is 0 0.55. Substitute all the values now. See here. After substituting gamma uh, sigma C dash, we got it as 8.66, which is the less than 11.33 Newton per mm square. So it is safe. So next, we have to find out the stresses in steel for tension zone. Sig uh, see here gamma s dash uh, sorry sigma s dash is equal to m into sigma c dash into a minus k dash by k dash so all the values are known sigma c dash also just found so substitute all the values then you will get sigma s as 56.28 uh, newton per mm square which is less than 230 newton per mm square so hence it is safe next c so uh, compression zone is over tension zone is over this is at the neutral axis we have to found, find find then you have to use a relation k is equal to minus mp root over 2 mpa plus p square m square all the values are known here again except k the k value is being changed in every case see here but all the values are remaining same p is a, again tc by t uh, sorry ts by tc ts is we got equivalent area of steel ring 4 by tc is a thickness of the chimney that is 400 so we got it as 0.01 so after that thickness of the chimney at the base we are talking about 400 not average thickness see here a is a 0 0.875 if we substitute all the values here we will get the k value as 0 0.342 now we have to find the stresses in concrete using this expression that is sigma ct is equal to ec alpha kt so all the values are known again here 
substitute all the values and you will get this 5.386 which is less than 11.33 that is safe stresses in steel we have to calculate again sigma st is equal to es alpha t into m s k so we have to use Young's modulus remaining is same so all the values are known here substitute all the values in this formula we will get 92.34 which is less than uh, 230 newton per mm square so it is safe step 9 this is about stresses in hoop steel due to the temperature uh, now we have to calculate the value so we have to use the relation p is equal to ast by s into tc s is here spacing uh, T, uh, tc is the thickness of the base uh, sorry thickness of the base uh, that is 400 mm ast is pi, pi, pi by 4 into 10 square that is the area of steel bar so after getting all the values substitute now in the formula p value we got it as 0.00098 this is a constant p is a constant now use the relation k dash is equal to root over 2 p m a p square m square minus p m so p value initially is different p value first is different p value again uh, with the p value we have three parameters please don't confuse here p value is being changed from this onwards we are we have been using the p value as 0 0.00098 see here after substituting all the values we will get this k dash is 0.127 now we have to use the relation sigma s dash is equal to m uh, sigma c dash into a minus k dash by k dash k dash was found and modular ratio is known a is known and we don't know sigma s dash and sigma c dash so we have to find out sigma s dash in terms of sigma c if we substitute all the values we find the value of sigma s dash in terms of sigma c dash so we got it as sigma s dash is equal to 60.45 sigma c dash now we have to use the relation sigma s dash plus uh, m sigma c dash is equal to e s alpha t a this is one more formula we have so after substituting this sigma s is the known value now that is 60.45 sig uh, sigma c dash substitute that and only unknown after substituting all the known values only unknown thing remains here is sigma c dash sigma c dash so if we solve for sigma c dash we will get it as 60 uh, 128.25 newton per mm square after sorry 2.12 2 newton per mm square so after substituting in this formula we get this sigma s dash value also as 128.25 newton per mm square that is 60.45 into sigma c dash so after substituting the value we got it as this total stress in the hoop steel is equal to stress due to shear plus stress due to the temperature difference so we have to add the both initially we have found the stress due to shear that is 129 is the 128.15 so that is 257.25 newton per mm square that is greater than uh, sorry uh, yes that is greater than 230 newton per mm square then what we have to do so it is within uh, greater than permissible stress so we have to strengthen the chimney by reducing the spacing between the hope reinforcement so we have to reduce the gap between the rings so from 200 to we are reducing it as 150 mm so design of foundation we shall see in the next part